my name is Tyler Tawangaba. I own business Cloud9 Recycling. I recycle cardboard, paper products. Under here, there's numerous magazines. A lot of the paper ends up in the landfill. So that that those that kind of stuff is actually what what I try to save from. And I also uh, recycle aluminum cans, metal, aluminum, copper, plastic. So. I did quite a bit of different uh, variety of recycling. The incubator program is pretty cool because I think it's been good to talk to Jessica. She's been a little real helpful, put, put things in perspective. So ultimately, it could be that I could have people working right now if I you know, had the res enough uh, financial resources and uh, just churning all this stuff out because the way I, I always say it's money sitting there, you know what I mean? So. If I could get it all processed and out of here, you know, I'd be making quite a bit of money right now, you know. So this is how we load a, put enough metal. Just jam it in there. This is my metal uh, cart here. So you just try to cram as much as you can because uh, the more you put in, the more weight you'll get at the metal yard. This is my electronics, you know, TVs. So anything that has a cord is what I say I, I recycle. Because what, you know, you just take them apart, there's a lot of uh, metal in it, wire. All right, this is my uh, aluminum can and plastic bottle recycling area. Sometimes this thing will be just uh, huge. The last run I had was like 200. 13 pounds of water bottles alone, so yeah, that's quite a bit. <laughs> yeah, it was a big mound. Yesterday I was at the flea market and this guy's like, oh, if you ever need help, you know, just let me know, you know, he's asking me to work, you know. So just people I've hired in the past, I've hired quite a few people, you know, to maybe load a truck, you know, a 24 foot budget truck, uh, take apart this stuff or do my cans, bag my bottles. So. I've, I've asked quite a few people, so, you know, they ask, do you have any work today? But sometimes I just don't have the funds to, you know, pay them. Just my existence is bringing that awareness, it seems, you know. I think somebody crazy enough to do it, you know. <laughs> I, I don't see why everybody doesn't realize this is why we should be living, you know. We should be conscious of recycling every little thing we possibly can because I thought that's what we were here for, stewards of the earth, you know? <laughs> but I guess it takes education, so somebody to actually do it. <laughs>